the second of the Paul Moore's finals next four mile three and a half furlong grade three handicap it's like the Grand National all over again National King at the top Joshua Sutherland Lottery John Morgan Cat Memorial Leon Van Rensburg National Prince Joshua Sutherland Mayhem on Ice Darren Thompson Dakla Wall James Shea El Centro Wonderful Vinnie Gerard, Katie Holmes Matt Cooper Dark and Tribulation James Shea Shona Fabiola David Robertson Brit John Morgan Well Done Jeannie David Robertson Emilino Padre Hogan and France for Matt Cooper a field of 14 away and racing would one final with a field of 28 have been more exciting I don't know anyway Britain Lottery are off into the lead from um, National Prince and National King then comes France and El Centro wonderful dark and tribulation after that one as they settled themselves down and the John Morgan pair have gone off into a clear lead and I'm going to set the pace. Interesting to see how this pans out as they take the first. And they're all safely over it. We need Lottery and Brit in the lead. This race the best part of a mile further than the last one and they're going at pretty much the same sort of pace. National Kings are falling, the top weight's gone there so that's a real surprise. And also one of those real disappointments isn't it when the top weight the one that's kept all the all the weights all the horses out of the handicap ends up crashing out of the race early on and bad luck to Josh he's still got National Prince in there who's I think he's probably the best treated of all of them at the moment weights wise but that one nearly went there as well so nothing to be taken for granted and Lottery and Brit are setting a strong pace from France who's moved through into third in comes National Prince Emilino is next in Dakla Wall and Dark and Tribulation with Shona Fabiola and Cat Memorial Mayhem on Ice watch out for that one as Darren Thompson is doing so well in these long distance chases at the moment that's the one the only one he had qualified as they take Beecher's Brook and the leading pair over it clear the rest of them likewise they've got an 8 to 10 length lead these two Lottery and Brit. So take the four Haven fence. Some of the John Morgan front row in the last race got run right out of it in the end. As they come down to the canal turn, Brit's got a considerably low water fall there, and it's France that's gone. The bottom weight, well, one of the ones out of the handicap, to be honest, is out of it. And I'll be interested in this Brit on the inside, haven't you? Number 11 off a really low weight as well. I'd have to be in with a good chance if that one can stay the trip and get round okay. It's certainly not got, a, not got any weight at all as they get over the 10th. National Prince is back in third, then Dakla Walk and Emelino. Dark and Tribulation is after that. And Shona Fabiola and El Centro, wonderful. With Mayhem and Ice and Cat Memorial as they get over this next one. And we'll safely over it. That'll be the final ditch on the next circuit. And this one will be the third last next time round. Katie Holmes is gone, and that's, ooh, that's that was my fancy for this. And Katie Holmes is gone. I think if I'm going to take them three against the field at the start of the race, I want to take them Katie Holmes and National Prince and Brit. And I've still got two chances. And it's Lottery and Brit who are disputing the lead. And there's a 10 length gap to National Prince in third. With Dark and Tribulation and Dakla Wall in Cat Memorial. With Mayhem and Ice and Shona Fabiola and Emilino. And El Centro Wonderful and finally. Well done, Genie. So, disappointment for Matt Cooper. Both of his head. He's had a good season. And hopefully, a lot of his good horses from this season will be back next season as well as they get over the 13th. And head towards the fence that'll be the last on the next circuit before they head for the chair. Britain Lottery take it together and together. Still 8 to 10 lengths clear of National Prince in third. Dark and Tribulation in fourth. 
and a gap back to Dakla Wall and Mayhem on Ice. In wide on the track, well done, Genie, showing a Fabiola, Emilino, and Centro, wonderful in the green. And Cat Memorial now just a back marker as they take the cheer. All safely over that. It's just 11 of them left. And we'll skip over the water. And a swing left handed, then now go past the point from where they started and do it all again with the exception of the chair and the water obviously they yeah, will have that big long running which can make a big difference with the weights with its Britain lottery have been matching strides all the way nothing to choose between the two of them at the moment Dark and Tribulations moved into third National Prince is fourth and Dakla Wall fifth, but they're pretty well strung out. They're in three definite groups now. A group of two in the lead, then a group of three battling out third place, and then the rest of them out the back as they get over. Oh, he's gone! Brit's gone! That was a disaster there for me, really, because I won what I picked, but it's not so good news for John Morgan either. And one of the leading pairs gone. That might explain why Brit got such a low weight. She's crashed out in lottery. Is now going to have to race on his own with a big weight, the highest weight in the field because the top weight's fallen, so the whole complexion of this race could well change now. Lottery leads only by six to Dark and Tribulation and National Prince together. Then Dakla Wall as they get over the 20th. Showing a Fabiola, and it's just the back marker now. As they head down to the one before Beaches and it's Lottery continuing to lead. National Prince over it in second. And then Dark and Tribulation and Dakla Walker. James Shea take both of John Moore's finals. He's in a good position to do so at the moment because he's got two in this and we're both well placed and going well. As they head for Beaches Brook for the final time. This time we'll see Beaches this season as they get over that one. It's Lottery in front, heading down to Fornhaven from National Prince and Dark and Tribulation. Then Dakla Wall El Centro, wonderful, has moved away from the pack at the back as they get over the 23rd. All safely over that with Weldon Genie, Cat Memorial, and Shona Fabiola, the back three. Down to the canal turn. Lottery's lead is the shortest it's been. The exception of Lady Hanover's stable companion Brit, but they were racing together really as they get over that canal turn. Lottery's lead is just three lengths now to Dark and Tribulation as they head into the Valentine's Brook for the final time. National Prince is in third. Jumped that one really well. Good jump too by El Centro. Wonderful who's gone past Dakla Wall. They're heading down towards the next. Then now five from home. Lottery in the lead. Dark and Tribulation. National Prince is after that one. Then comes El Centro, wonderful, and Dakla Wall. And then a gap to Mayhem on Ice, who's starting to make some ground. So too is Cat Memorial. This is the final ditch, the fourth last. And safely over that one, Lottery's lead just a length and a half. National Prince in second, Dark and Tribulation third. Mayhem on Ice now making good ground as they get over the third last. All over that one mistake at the back there by Emelino, who's probably out of it anyway. But it's Lottery still too clear from National Prince in second. Look at this mayhem on ice coming through. El Centro Wonderful's coming with it as well. Dark and Tribulation now. It's a bit of a flat spot, but they're heading towards the final two, and Lottery's kicked for home. Lottery's in the lead then from Mayhem on ice, chasing hard in second. Then comes National Prince and El Centro Wonderful. Dark and Tribulation is after that one. Then Dakla Wall showed a Fabiola. He's running on. They've got two to jump and fourth furlongs to race and Lottery is heading down to the second last still clear in the lead by four to five National Princess back into second El Centro wonderful third Dark and Tribulation next Mayhem on Ice is now starting to labour Dakla will try to run on again Cat Memorial and Shona Fabiola after that one over the second last they go and it's still Lottery Lottery still clear by three from National Prince who's second El Centro wonderful is in third these are the big two now pulling away are they it's Lottery coming towards the final fence in the Paul Moore's final. It's Lottery in the lead from National Prince over it in second. These two are well clear of the 
rest of them as they head down towards the elbow. It's Lottery who's been in the lead all the way, but National Prince is beginning to close. Lottery's in front. National Prince is three lengths behind and is starting to reach into that lead. Lottery's beginning to tire. Here comes National Prince. They're coming past the elbow. It's Lottery in the lead. National Prince is getting closer, but Lottery's still got a two length lead with half a furlong to go. Lottery's hanging on. Here comes National Prince. Lottery's got to hang on and take it, I think. Up towards the line, it's got to be Lottery that takes it. Then Gallant National Prince is second, back in third. May and I think Captain Morial Dark and Tribulation Dakla will show the Fabiola finish well. Emelino was the last one to finish. And pillar to post, just about for Lottery may have been headed a few times by his stable companion Brit before that one fell, but Lottery took it off a massive weight for John Morgan. National Prince was second for Joshua Sutherland. Mayhem on ice for Darren Thompson, third. Cap Memorial, Leon Van Rinsburg, fourth. And Shona Fabiola was fifth for David Robertson.